Welcome back to Quantum Mayo on today's November 16th daily challenge. We're going to be using Scorpion level 70 and we're going to be taking on this challenge with the Kunai Epic Plus 2. Primary gear will be the army gear, army nameplate. We have the eternal belt, eternal suit, and for cooldown, the army boots. So let's get to it. Ah, looks like we're extra big. Does anybody know if that does anything? I'm just curious, it's kind of funny. All right, forgot to read the second thing. Picking up our drone. Picking up our gold. Cool like this with a big character. Let's you see those headphones that do nothing. All right, let's see if we can avoid getting hit. And we've got the drone. Let's go for the drill shot. We've got enhancement on that, 30% speed. And force field, always nice. Molotov. Looks like this one doesn't have enhancement. And finally, we got some Kanai. We're looking for the Evo on the Kanai, which is going to be the Ninja Scroll. Now we got our Elite, and well, you can really see that inspiration with this big size. Looks like we're getting the train. All good upgrades. Alright, at this point we've got our extra damage, 50% across the board, as well as the 20%, or rather 30% cooldown from the boots, so we are at 70% right now. We almost got hit by that purple slot. Alright, let's activate the rocket. The epic on it is just basically a little bit extra cooldown. I thought it would be more exciting than that, but hey, at least it's an epic. I actually like the rocket. A lot of people don't, but when you do the cooldown, the rocket becomes a lot better. A lot faster firing rate. Even the dreaded shark maw is not bad. Alright, I guess we're going to go with a little bit of healing in case we need it, and that will help Evo the shield. And what we're looking for is the Shuriken. Or Shuriken. Alright. That's where we're going to go. Rocket damage doubled. Add a rocket. No. Oops. Up. Oh, there's the Evo. Almost missed it. Sometimes you got to, like, pause for a second. Alright, Evo is locked in for the Kunai, so that's good. We're going to keep developing drones, defenses. I think we're going to get hit here. Maybe. Yep. Alright, got this boat. Let's just clear out of here. Alright, get the Kunai going. I'm confident once we get the Kunai to its Evo, we're going to be in good shape. Alright, we're going to do extra rocket. See what the boss is. It's a turret. Alright. I hope we can just orbit this guy and let the drone do something with it. Well, that doesn't take too long. And there is the shuriken symbol. Alright, we're done. Let's see, we got let's just go force field. Keep him from hitting us. I don't know if we're going to get the second drone, so let's just max that drone out to make sure it's doing the most it can. Going to do some flight speed. More rocket damage. I guess we're going to get the Shark Maw at this point. I don't see fire showing up yet. I'm not terribly worried about that Evo. I'd rather have more force field and more force field light up. Oh, more rocket. I smell Shark Maw in the works. Alright, force field. Alright, here's the Evo for that. 
going to take it. Right. At this point, we should be covered. And not get hit. Let's see if they're making it across. Nope, I think we're good. This map has these interesting buildings that you can hide behind, but the bosses can destroy them. Kind of neat. It's the first destructible terrain that I've seen in this game. I've seen it come up in another daily challenge about a month ago. Alright, we are golden. Coming up on three minutes. So we got about another minute to the first boss. Right now, the smart money is on just staying in the middle here. Looks like they've got some kind of energy crap they're firing that hasn't hit me yet. So as long as we stay here, all right, now we can collect and get our magnet. Otherwise, I would have gone for the weapon range. All right, I think our clock speed is fast enough right now that we can take them all out before they touch me. The wheel would have been a good choice. I don't remember seeing it in the options, but wheel or the fire would have been ideal. I think we got a little bit of fire going, but not as much as I want. Alright, coming up on the boss. I'm just going to stay right there. Right, let's increase our range. Excellent. King Crab. Alright, this guy should be pretty easy. Alright, we're gonna do Molotov. Hopefully we can get that up. Yeah, let's just keep working the Molotov if we get it. Excellent. That's gonna help us out when we get mobbed after this guy. Alright, I knew we'd get that Shark Maw gun. We're gonna go Molotov. See, I should've gotten the gold. If the gold comes out, we're gonna take it. Overtime effect, that's good for fire. That's the other one you want. Weapon range. Alright, can I start to work well? Alright, see with the cooldown, you can see how fast I'm throwing out the shark moths, so... 70% cooldown, not bad. Hey, and I see a chest up here. Let's see if we can make our way over there without getting touched. Alright, we got all attack cooldown, the energy cube, very nice. I think we can pick up the chest from here, and we can. Not much of a chest, but we'll take it. Alright, at this point we're dealing death pretty well. The Kunai, as you can see, is just taking everything out. Some would argue that the Kunai is not an area effect weapon. On the other hand, its firing rate is so fast, it's like a smart Gatling gun. In fact, the Kunai is what the Gatling should have been. Oh, we got hit. Alright, so if that's the case, now we can kind of pick up some crystals since I don't have inspiration running. Hoping to fight the boss with the extra cooldown, but we'll be alright. Never know, an elite might show up. I don't think that's going to show up at this late, though. Alright, we got 30 seconds, 25 seconds coming up. Alright, keep that fire going. Actually, let's go with the drill. Maybe we can Evo it for the whistling arrow. Alright, Savage King. Let's see. I remember this guy being kind of a pain in the ass. Alright, now he can destroy the building, so... Kind of keep an eye on him. 
keeping our distance. We're pretty much wasting. Let's get up there with the drone. I just heard him croak. Uh, so what difference does it make what we hit? Let's just hit the magnet. And boom, we're done. Hey, we didn't die. Not even with the uh, revive needed from the suit. Decent loot haul. A couple of parts. Let's open the chest. That's what's really the whole point of this, isn't it? Alright, da da da. First chest, one part, some coin, some gems, two parts, and 20 gems, three parts, including a precision device. Alright, let's see what we've achieved on our daily here. Don't forget your dailies, you gotta keep going back and hitting that stuff, clearing them out. Alright, so let's go into the tech parts. To emerge and we got a lot of stuff let's see what we get excellent we got a blue two green not a bad little haul and these are the tech parts on this guy we're running antimatter generator epic of course the precision device that's on all my characters we got the annihilator for the laser we got the compression for the shield chop wheel and the rocket high maintainer and we can't open any chest today but we will on another character so that about wraps it up on this daily challenge oops we'll do one more thing we'll level up to Kanai boom level 67 all right thanks for watching and I'll see you when we do the next character on our next video. Later.